Hello, my name is Gary Butler from a Sage 200 Support Consultant. Today, we'll be looking at where to go to hide old normal accounts, sales ledger accounts, purchase ledger accounts that you don't use anymore, so you can't select them by accident within Sage 200. Within Sage 200, you're able to hide old accounts that you don't use anymore. So for example, if you've got a customer or a supplier that you don't trade with anymore, or you've got nominal code that you don't use. So start off with, we'll have a look in the normal ledger. So within a normal list, what we will do is we'll highlight a code we don't use anymore. So we're going to look for a vehicle depreciation code, and then we'll go to amend accounts. Within here, we can see it's got a flag, which is an active status flag. So if I drop it down, you can see the status of active and the status of hidden. Now, if you use hidden, it doesn't delete the account. The account is there forever and a day. However, you will not be able to select it or see it. If I now save it, so 08205 is gone. So if I try to do a journal, zero eight two oh five you cannot select it and if we realize that we made a mistake and that code shouldn't be hidden close out of here amend account zero eight two oh five so in this screen it does show the code because we have to get it back somehow we change the status back to active and save it. If we look at the list and refresh, it's enabled again for us. So if we now go back into journal entry, 08205 has returned. So now we need to do the same thing with customers and suppliers. It's slightly similar, but slightly different. So if we go into the purchase ledger, for example, and we've got a list of codes here and we'll say Fleetwise, we highlight the code and go to account status at the top. Within here, we have an active status flag, which we can change from active to hidden. If I save that, refresh, so Fleetwise has disappeared. When we go into the invoice, Let's try and select it, but as you can see, it doesn't show. So basically now if we go back into account status, select the right account, change it from hidden to active and save. If I refresh, it's back on the list again. Virtually identical is in the sales ledger, exactly the same options in the account status screen. And that's how you make accounts inactive in Sage 200. Thank you for watching our video today on how to hide sales, purchase, and nominal accounts from view and selection within Sage 200. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe and please check out our website for any other details. Uh, and have a good day. Thank you.